For over 25 centuries, the great universities of the world have always had three fundamental missions. The creation of knowledge, that is of research and innovation, the dissemination of knowledge, and that is education and learning, and the preservation of knowledge. This initiative came from several faculty members who approached the Office of the Vice Provost for Research, uh, telling us that some of the tape recordings, uh, some of the video, and even film on campus were degrading quickly and rapidly, and they were worried about it. Uh, I thought maybe we'd have a few tapes and a few films, but they came up with over 600,000 items. This content's unique in that, in some cases, the actual audiovisual material of the film has started to corrode, it may not be usable, or the equipment that you would use to view or listen to this content no longer exists. There are some really valuable items here, and how do we take care of them forever so that the scholars can actually access them? One of the goals of the MDPI project is to make this material accessible and available to a much broader uh, community. Let's think about films right now. In order for a faculty member or student to use one of the films that we have in the library, for example, they need to come into the library and view it there or perhaps check it out to a classroom. But if this is done correctly and we can work through all the intellectual property rights, that material would be available to a much broader audience and in a much more uh, transparent manner. Digitizing them now is uh, very important so that we can preserve them for uh, over a long period of time and make those available for scholars not only at Indiana University but all other universities around the world.